Hi YouTube, we haven't made a video for a while so I thought I'll make one. Um, today I'm going to show you how to turn your laptop into a wireless router. Uh, it's pretty simple actually. Um, everything you need is already on Windows. Now this technique, well the way I'm showing you today is for Windows 7 or Windows Vista but it can also be done in a similar way on Windows XP. So basically what you, know, what you want to do is go to control panel, so you go to start, uh, control panel, down here, and you move up to network and internet, and network and sharing center. Now basically you want to click on set up a new network, uh, new connection or network. Now it's a bit hard to see but you scroll down to set up a wireless ad hoc network. So you just click on that and you click next and next again. Basically all you do is you just come up with a name so let's just call it test. So your network name is test and you just leave um, just leave the security type and just it comes up with um, instructions for your security key. Basically you need um, 8 to 63 characters um, using the digits 0 to 9 and letters A to F. So I'm just going to call it A, B, C, D, E, F, 1, 2, 3, 4, because that's um, over 8 characters and it's easy to remember. Um, then you just go next, you wait a little bit, and there we go. Now, if you wanted to, say, share your internet connection, Say if you've um, only got your internet connected to this one computer, for example, your say you have um, a wireless 3G modem, so which is mobile broadband, you can just go to um, <coughs> Network and Sharing Center, and basically, I'll just move over to here because I've got it connected to this computer, and let me just get there, and there it is here. There we go. Uh, that's my mobile broadband network. Now you just click on that and you go properties and you go sharing and you just allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet, which is pretty simple. You just click OK and then anyone who connects to your wireless network should be able to connect to the internet as well, which is fairly handy. Say if you're on holidays or something and you've got a few people who want to use the internet and yeah, you can just share yours, it's up to you. Anyway, um, I hope you found this video useful. If you're not already subscribed, feel free to do so or just check out our channel. Ask us a question if you have any. Um, thanks for watching.